Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Cinnamon Stitches. I am your yarn host Jennifer and I, while I'm getting ready for this video, I'm going to put plug in some of my batteries. I also need to find the cord for my mouse because that's dead. But my wonderful lovely son keeps coming in here and stealing my cords. So there's that. It ain't just him. It's Mr. Cinnamon too. Oh, mommy's got a cord. We can't find ours. We better go steal hers. charge good deal <clears throat> still under the weather I'm still under the weather but I got a box of red tape and that makes me happy so we're gonna record it I may rearrange this week's videos I'm not sure um, I ordered in case you don't know thank you for choosing premier yarns that's new. I don't remember them having that on the box. <clears throat> in case you don't know, in case you haven't been following me, Premier Yarns, as of the recording of this video, which was today, July 31st is having a big summer clearance sale. I don't know how long the sale is lasting because I don't think that the website says. I will double check. Oops, undo. Let's see. It just says big summer sale. It does not say when, say when the sale is going to end, so I don't know. Um, up to... Oh, it says extra low prices on 50 plus of your favorite yarns, including special selections sourced directly from Turkey... I actually placed two orders. Mr. Cinnamon actually sponsored this episode, so... <clears throat> Excuse my voice. I am... I have something. I don't know. I caught something. I caught something from my niece bringing home germs from little kids at <laughs> the daycare. I'm convinced of it. Um, I ordered from the big summer sale, and then... The next day they added more yarns, and I'm going to talk about those yarns, and I'm going to show you what I have in this box, but I don't think, I, I don't know that I have any of those yarns in here, but yeah, it doesn't look like I have any of those. So part of the big summer sale, they are ha they have yarns from, Him it's called Himalaya Yarns. I have purchased Himalaya yarns before, not from Premier Yarns directly. I have purchased Himalaya yarns from Hershner's. Now, they have bags of five for five dollars. So it's five balls of yarn for five dollars. And I said this in the video when I was announced the sale, is that the Himalaya yarns are smaller 50 gram skeins of yarn. So they're, they're like half the size of a normal skein of yarn. But still, 5 for 5 is a really good deal. And they have yarn called denim, but it's 100% cotton. And cotton, I mean, Premier Yarns has cotton. It's a cotton polyester blend, though. And the polyester can melt. And so these are good for, like, washcloths and stuff like that. But they're not good for, like, hot pads or things like that. The 100% cotton is much better for hot pads because cotton's not going to melt. And so, the denim, from what I read, is 100% cotton. I did order some of that. That order has not shipped yet. Um, but 5 for $5. Like, there was a time these went on sale for a dollar each. And that is a fantastic deal. And I would stock up when they're a dollar each. Um, <clears throat> and I tend to do that. If I see a really good sale on cotton, I will stock up. But they have been... Two two fifty lately, and I'm just not I'm not paying that for washcloths. I'm not doing it. Um, but they had several varieties, and I ordered a couple of the Himalaya type yarns. They still seem to have a lot left. Um, I'm gonna show you what I did purchase. What I purchased are yarns I've used before and yarns that I like. And because Premier does not include a receipt, I'm gonna pull out my receipt on the website which also does not generally give me prices of what I paid but um, well that's not the right order 
I am so tired of the scam emails coming in. Oh, is it? Oh, the prices are on here. All right. I just want to make sure everything is in here. All right. So I ordered the rustic. The rustic is on sale, or was when I ordered it. It should still be. I don't know when the sale is going to end. Like I said, but the rustic is on sale for three dollars and fifty cents. Normally seven dollars a ball, so it's fifty percent off. I really, really like the rustic, and I think I have a ball or two left over from the last time I ordered it. Rustic does not come in a lot of colors. It's a bulky five. I have mixed this with the puzzle, but it's a little bit thicker than the puzzle yarn. But it's a nice, soft, squishy yarn. It makes fantastic blankets and winter gear. So I ordered it in the color cyan. Both of these colors I've had in the past. <laughs> and I ordered it in warm gray. And because it's half off, it's basically buy one, get one free. Depending on how you want to look at it, 50% off, buy one, get one free. So I bought one, got one free, technically. And it's got a beautiful <clears throat> heathered look to it. But it's really, really soft and squishy. And because it's bulky, it works up really quick. And 50% off. I'm going to be real honest. If I had more money... If Mr. Cinnamon gave me more money or I had more money, I would have ordered more of these because this is a good yarn to have for quick blankets, for this makes really nice squishy hats, um, scarves, and they work up quick because it's fatter, but it's also really, really squishy. So I did a review on the Rustic somewhere on the channel. Just search Cinnamon Stitches Rustic and it should show up. If you can't find it, let me know. I will find the video for you, but... It's a good quality yarn. I also ordered... I also ordered the, the Serenity Candy. I also have... I have a tutorial using this yarn for the Boggy Creek Blanket. Um, this is on sale $3 a ball or 3 for 9 which I think is a good deal because... These are normally $3.99, so I, it wasn't like the best deal. It's 25% off if you want to get technical. But, again, bulky number five yarn, right? I'm almost confident. I'm doing all this off of memory. I know Premier Yarns yarns like the back of my hand. Matter of fact, I probably know the yarn better than I know the back of my hand because I don't stare at the back of my hands as much as I stare at my yarn. So... <laughs> <laughs> with that this is the serenity candy it is a number five it's chunky this is the color sprinkles sprinkles these don't have a lot of yardage on them but these very much like the rustic any of the serenity yarns i like um you can also mix the rustic with the serenity just saying um it's more along the thickness of the serenity if i remember let me just crack this open. No, it's thicker than the Serenity. It's just slightly thicker. I, I could show you, but you're not going to see it. You have to feel the difference. But this comes in lots of really fun colors. Um, I have worked the candy up in knit and crochet, and it's beautiful in either. Um, I would not do... Um, intricate designs because you're not going to see it with this 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 fabric of this yarn is very wild and very colorful and um, it's a lot of fun but don't do intricate like I wouldn't even do shells like I would keep it singles half doubles or double crochets just because anything else is going to get lost in the busyness from the colors um, super quick hats this makes really good blankets, and I know because we have the Boggy Creek blanket that we did using this yarn. I really like using a really busy body fabric like this mixed with a solid. So you take one of the colors from here, and you do like a row of solid, a row of color. Something like this. So you alternate the colors. That's what I would do with the candy. And it's only... It's only 109 yards, so you're not going to make a whole... You're going to need 
I think I needed 12 balls to make the blanket that we did the tutorial for somewhere around there but not a bad price for that and I, I really like the candy and I was waiting for it to go on sale for a while to purchase some more uh, really like the candy now the rest in here is cakes the cakes were on a killer deal um, people I swear I'm sorry it's just all day <laughs> <clears throat> all day the cakes were three bag of three for 12 a bag of three so they were i, I will we'll go one by one okay sweet roll vivid these were three dollars a ball or three for nine i mean you, you can do math three times three is nine <laughs> This is my favorite color of the the Premier Vivid. The Vivid yarns are neons, fluorescent, electric colorways, which is why they're called Vivid. This is the color. It's electric. This one is my favorite, and I don't know why, but I made car seat covers in this yarn. In my, they're actually in my van right now. So my car seats are covered in these this colorway specifically. I also colored. If you guys remember, if you've been around, you remember I had the pink chair in here, which I'm missing the pink chair, but the pink chair is really low. So I, if I'm sitting at the desk in my pink chair, my arms are up here on the desk because it's much lower than the black chair that's Mr. Cinnamon's chair. And it's just a plain old ugly black chair. The pink chair, which is in the garage, had a pillow here and a lumbar pillow, and it was fantastic. And it had a foot stool that slid out. The pillows I covered in this yarn, and so I used it so I didn't have any more of the It's Electric. This one's my favorite color. The way the purples and the orange and the pink and the yellow just go together, it makes my brain so happy. So I ordered three of these because $3 is a good price for those. These, I think, are normally 4 or $5. Four, these are $5 a ball. $5 a cake normally. So three. this is what I'm saying. You guys, I could not pass up the sale. Uh, and then batik 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 alright then I ordered three of the momenti um, I also have a tutorial for the momenti I believe we made I want to say it was a cowl I want to say it was a cowl I will try to remember to link some of the things I'm talking about in this video but if I don't remember, if you just go to Google and you search cinnamon stitches and you put momenti or cinnamon stitches tutorials, all of my tutorials will pop up. I try to categorize them, but I, I very often forget to do that. So they're not actually in a full playlist. One day I will sit down when I have more time and I will put everything into the proper tutorial playlist um, or search Premier yarn or, gener or cinnamon stitches premiere week because I believe that the moment he was part of one of the premiere week tutorials and I'm fairly confident it was a cowl or a scarf because it was open lace work and the reason I did something small is because this is not machine washable and I, I kept that into consideration when I'm doing a tutorial with a specific yarn if it's not machine washable I tend to steer away from clothing because I don't want you to have to hand wash it I mean sometimes I break that rule but most of the time I'm like if they're gonna hand wash something I I don't want it to be a big garment you know so the momenti is beautiful this is a bag of three for twelve dollars these normally a bag of three says eighteen dollars <clears throat> trying to remember how much the momenti is normally I want to say it was eight or nine dollars see now it's saying the momenti is eighteen dollars for a bag of three yeah so the price I paid for this is better than what it is right now so I paid twelve dollars for a bag of three of these Are they discontinuing the momenti? Because I'm not seeing it other than in a bag of three. And it's saying the bag of three is normally $32. These are 
these were not cheap um, in a regular circumstance. So the fact that I got three for 12 is really a good deal. Um, yeah, I also had rewards. So that actually made my price come down even more from the grand total, which I was fantastic. I had $15 in rewards. So <laughs> I technically got this for free. <laughs> so this yarn is, the rest of these yarns I'm showing you are acrylic. This one is 58% cotton, 42% acrylic. Um, it's chain spun, if I recall. And what chain spun is, is instead of it just being a, a string or a twisted string, it's like it has been knitted into a tube already. This is the best way that I can describe it. It's like the fabric of the, the yarn fat fibers, it's almost like a long knitted tube. Okay, that's the best way that I can say it. Um, I got it in the color Reef. So it has yellow, well like a yellow green, an aqua, a navy blue. So this is navy blue in here. It's looking black on the screen. It's navy blue and then there's like a purpley color, which is looking blue. But it's really, really pretty. It's heavy. This is, like I said, it's a hand wash, dry flat type of situation because the cotton wool just do things. It's 437 yards per cake. So we have enough to make almost a whole top out of this. <clears throat> and then the last three bags were the Batik. So anti-pilling DK Colors Batik. I've also done a tutorial for this yarn. This yarn I did the Tulip Cardigan or the Tulip Cardi, which is a pattern from Premier Yarns. It's on their website. Uh, they allowed me to do the tutorial for the Tulip Cardi. And I used the Batik. And I love, love this yarn. And it was on three for six dollars, which is a killer deal for this. You have no idea. All right. <clears throat> so I grabbed three colors I I don't have. Matter of fact, I don't know that I have a whole lot of this left. <clears throat> My favorite color of this is the blue and the pink one. But I decided to get colors I don't have or haven't had because it's kind of silly to keep buying the same yarn over and over again in the same color, even though it's my favorite. <laughs> but my favorite is the, the blue and pink one. So this one is the color Pool Party. This is 100% anti-pilling acrylic, which makes the three for six dollars even a better deal um, because anti-pilling acrylic is my favorite. It's soft. It's luxurious feeling on your hands. Like it's, it's silky and like smooth and soft and squishy. But it's machine washable and dryable 300 times and it will not get pills on it which is why it's called anti-pilling and it's guaranteed to hold up for whatever you're making baby items garments it's guaranteed to hold up blankets and it's really soft and if you don't know i have skin issues i have eczema i have really high sensitivity to things i also have um where I have allergic reactions to things with my skin is the first thing that shows up with I'm oh you're allergic I'm gonna bleed <laughs> like blister bleed like all that good stuff the reason I tell you that is because when I tell you a yarn is soft it is a higher standard of soft because I am so sensitive to yarns that's the reason I bring it up so frequently because there are a lot of people like me in the world who cannot use certain brands or certain types of yarn because of eczema allergies sensitivities whatever the issues are psoriasis like there's a lot of things and people value that in my opinion I'm just gonna say that I've gotten hundreds of emails about thank you so much for given us the scale on your eczema <laughs> like is it gonna blister you is it gonna rip your skin open and all those things so so anti-pilling acrylic in most instances is my top go-to acrylic yarn it's my go-to it's my go-to of all yarns anti-pilling acrylic is top on my list 
So this has a beautiful watercolory effect to it, which is what batik means. Batik is a type of dyeing. It's a type of the way they watercolor dye it. I don't know. But um, you can find fabrics that are batik. You can find, like, this is what it knits up like. But the watercolored effect still comes through if you crochet. So this, like I said, well, this is pool party. Is beautiful shades of blues and whites. Yeah, a bag of three of that. I grabbed Playtime, which is pinks and grays, but the grays are kind of like taupe leaning, so it's like beigey gray. It's it's like grayish, like beige gray. So it's got there's white, there's like a lighter gray beige here than pink, and then a darker gray. I know it's really hard to see on camera. I'm trying to keep these in the packaging so that I can store them better because um, storage is a problem. And then I got the color Lucky Duck, <coughs> which is grays, or not gray, it's greens and yellows. Really, really pretty, really soft, really squishy. And because I had the $15 in rewards, use your rewards, people. Sign up for that rewards. I'm telling you, it's worth the money. This order, let me double check what, what the price came out to. I want to say it was 47 but I could be wrong. <clears throat> With tax and everything, See, this says 54. That's not what I paid. So it says 54, and then it says shipping was only $5. I don't know how I got $5 shipping on that. Um, then they, they charged me state and county tax. So the total before my coupon was $62. And then, let me do some math. Clear. 62 minus 15. 47 see I told you it was 47 so I paid $47 and let me see 3 6 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 I got 20 skeins of yarn for $47 which means I paid $2.35 per ball of course, that's going to be different for you if you don't have rewards. It's going to be slightly more than that, but you cannot beat $2 for some of those yarns. You just can't. Um, that's why I was like, I was complaining to Mr. Cinnamon. I was like, ugh. He's all, place the order. I was like, I, it's not that I don't have money right this second. It's my money is allocated to other things that are a priority right now. So it's not like my bank account is empty, but the money that's in there has to go to like taxes and the groceries and the car note and like it's allocated, <laughs> right? <coughs> and so I tell him like, I ain't got the money for that right now. Like it's not in the budget. And so he's all placed an order. And I was like, no, like that. I'm not doing that. I don't need yarn, et cetera, et cetera. He's all placed the order. I'm like, I mean, if you're going <laughs> to insist, I'll place the order. And then um, a couple days later, one of my bills dropped off. And I was like, I have a couple dollars. I'm going to place another order. And then I have another order coming in. And it was the Himalayan yarns because they dropped the Himalaya yarns. And so Premier Yarns announced. And then they were talking about what the different yarns were in one of their videos. And I was like, well, I could use some 100% cotton for a dollar a ball. Because <laughs> I have a whole bucket of cotton up there, but I don't have a lot of 100% cotton. I have the Premier Yarn style cotton, or I have the fancy, this is 100% cotton, but this is meant to make a garment out of. And the denim being $5 here. I'll just give you a preview of what I ordered, okay? So I ordered, this is the denim, this is the denim, this is the denim. Five balls for $5. Aren't those colors beautiful? And then I ordered one of the lollipops. And the lollipop yarn, I believe she said was nylon in the video. And it was five for five. And 
it looks furry like fuzzy furry and nylon and those two combinations together are really really soft and I have a knitting I have a couple knitting machines back there and I really like taking those really soft fluffy yarns and turning them into hats Because there's nothing better than a really soft, fluffy hat. Let me see if I can find one. Okay, so this, I'll show you these on Monday Makes because this is, that's all from this week, okay? This outer yarn out here is ridiculously <clears throat> rough and scratchy. This is not any of the yarn I'm talking about from Premier Yarns. This is stuff I got from like thrift stores, okay? So we got this beautiful, sparkly, really rough, gross yarn that will not ever touch my skin. <laughs> Okay, it feels nasty, but I can work it up in a knitting machine. This is a kid size hat. I have an adult size in the same exact, so it's like a matching set. The inside is this ultra, ultra soft. I think it might be a cotton blend, but it's like, I want to live on this. It's a cloud. That's how soft the yarn is. Um, it reminds me of Cumulus, which I can't remember the brand name of that. I did a tutorial with the Cumulus yarn. It's, it's, I, I wouldn't be surprised if it was the Cumulus. It's a light, fluffy, just deliciously soft yarn, okay? And so it works up really good in the knitting machine and it makes beautiful, beautiful hats that make beautiful insides to hats so that I can put rough, scratchy, but glittery yarn on the outside and you can walk around with it like, and it's so glittery, like it's not showing up, but I love putting the soft, delicious yarn on the inside. Here's another example. <clears throat> this one is pearl side out because for some reason the furry yarn, the pearl side on the knitting machine is way fluffier and soft. But this one is, I know it's not showing up, it is extremely fluffy and fuzzy and hairy, but it's really soft. And I love, love putting those kind of yarns in my knitting machine because my knitting machine, A, doesn't eat them, but also makes these really nice, soft, delectable hats that I just love making. So that's why I ordered the lollipop to throw in the knitting machine. And I only, only ordered the one color. And it also makes really nice scarves, like um, cowls and, and scarves and all that. And so I did order just one pack of that just to test it out in the knitting machine. And I know what's going to happen. I'm going to fall in love with it. And I'm not going to be able to find it again because it will have either been sold out or it was a temporary thing or whatever. But very often when I run across those really soft fluffy yarns, it's at a thrift store because people don't know what to do with those. Like, what am I going to do with 50 grams of, like, fluff? I know what to do with it. Crank it, crank it. Beautiful hat. <laughs> Sometimes a nice fluffy scarf. Um... And I've been doing a lot of projects with that style yarn, so that's why that order should be coming within the next couple of days. I don't know if I'll show it on the channel or not. I mean, I might, but I did order the denim, which is 100% cotton. I've never used it before, but I mean, cotton is cotton, right? If you're making washcloths with it. And it could be, I'm saying at a dollar ball, it's going to be washcloth quality cotton, not necessarily wearables, but I don't know. I've never touched it, felt it, looked at it. I just really like the acid wash colors, which I will show you again because they're really pretty. So the green on top is the fluffy nylon -y yarn that's kind of furry, and then these three are the denim, they're cotton. I just thought those colors were beautiful. They also had like a dark denim color, they had a bunch of colors, so um, I was not about to pass up that deal on Premier Yarns, not at all. So thank you to Mr. Cinnamon for always supplying the hoard. <laughs> for always providing me with yarny content for honestly doing whatever it does to make me happy because he knows the yarn makes me happy and he knows that it makes me smile and I love coming on here and showing you guys yarn. I love sharing sales with you. And I just like... I really like when people go into the Facebook group and they're like, look what I got from the sale. Thank you so much, Jennifer. And I like seeing what other people picked out because I know what I like.
but I don't know what you guys like. And I like seeing what you picked. And I like seeing the variety. Sometimes I will think, oh, I don't like that color. And then one of you will buy it and go, look what I bought. And then I'm like, oh, that color is way prettier in person than it is online. And that's why these videos are fun. Because you might look at this candy yarn and go, oh, I am not using that. And then you see it worked up and you're like, wow, that's kind of cool. <laughs> you know? So, um... I think that's it for today. I want to say this is a pee-yow video, but I can't do the high-pitched pee-yow right now because my throat is really jacked up. I was trying to sing Fall Out Boy yesterday. We're in the car, and I was I was trying to sing because I love, love, love Fall Out Boy. It's like my hyperfixation right now. And I was trying to sing some of my favorite songs, and I just could not hit those notes. And I look over at Mr. Cinnamon, and I was so sad. I was like, my throat hurts. <laughs> He's all I know. I was like, I don't sing very well today. <laughs> I don't sing good on a normal basis, but I still will belt it out because it makes me happy to sing. I love music. I love singing. I love dancing. I don't care who's around. Um, and normally I could hit some pretty high notes and not sound god awful. I get that from my dad. My dad was like, he, my dad was the same way, but um, I mean, I don't sound awful. I don't sound like a professional, but I don't sound awful, and I can't sing right now, and it's, I just want to sing. I've been walking around the house this morning. I have a song stuck in my head. I have been singing it for three hours, and then I finally got the song out of my head, right? And it's a, it's a Fall Out Boy song, and the words are, um, now it's lost. Now I can't find it. Anything you say can and will be held against you, so only say my name, it will be held against you. Okay, love it. It's it's in my head, right? And I finally got it out of my head. I sang it enough that it left my head, right? And then I'm watching a cop video, and he goes... <laughs> he starts to read her Miranda rights. I was like, dang it, there's that song again! <laughs> Anything you say can and will be held against you. <laughs> and then I started singing again, and I'm like... I. My throat hurts. I need to shut up. <laughs> but here we are. <clears throat> so, with that, I'm going to let you go. I hope you enjoyed seeing me unbox my beautiful Premier Yarns from the, the big summer sale. I'm so excited they had a good sale. Like, it's been a while since they had a really good sale. I mean, it's been a while. And I was just so excited to participate in a really good sale from them. It's been a while. And um, anyone who clicked my link... Thank you so much. It made a difference. Um, I actually... <clears throat> I haven't been using my Premier Link for a while. And, like, to watch my link go whoop in sales, I was like, yay! <laughs> I was excited. Premier was excited, too. They were like, good job. Welcome back. I was like, well, okay. Okay. <laughs> I really just shared because it was a really good sale and I know you guys would kill me if I didn't give you the deal. Like if I didn't tell you that sale, you guys would be so mad at me. I already know. Why didn't you tell me that sale was on while it was going? I told you on all the platforms. If you didn't see that video, that's not my fault. You should watch every one of my videos because I slide information in there for you. I actually did post it on Instagram. I posted on um, YouTube. I posted it as a post, but I also did a small video so that everyone would had a, had a chance to see or participate in the sale because the boutique, I, I had a couple people ask, like, what's your favorite out of it? Like, which one would you pick? The boutique. <clears throat> Three for six dollars. You can't beat that. That yarn's delicious. It's anti pilling acrylic. The cake's definitely the vivid. The vivid. I probably should have ordered more of the Vivid, but, I mean, like I said, Mr. Cinema was paying, and I don't take advantage of him, even though he's my husband. Um, so, yeah, those were my recommendations. Everything in that box, I would tell you, is, good, is a good buy. And even if the cotton is not the highest quality, a dollar a ball for the cotton that's supposed to be shipped out soon, I mean, snap it up if you work with cotton, if you make washcloths or hand towels or anything like that. Snap it up. Hot pads. Snap it up. Snap it up. And I have tutorials for all those things here. I have hand towels. I have washcloths. Um, I don't think I have a hot pad tutorial. 
but it's not like they don't exist. I mean, between me and Jada and Stitches, like, you can find anything. Anything. <laughs> or Glenda from Iowa. She has all that stuff, too, so, you know with that there's a lot of there's a lot of really amazing talented people out there that you can get a tutorial for any of the things i'm talking about but um <clears throat> with that i'm gonna let you go i will see you in the next one if the premier yarns big summer sale is still going on check it out use my link if you purchase that really does help support the channel and my family and um if you did purchase from the sale what did you buy that you like really thought was the best deal i, I want to hear it tell me in the comments I like, I like having, even if it's not a two-way conversation, I like reading the comments and just taking note of what you guys bought. I, I really do like reading the comments. I, I cannot possibly respond to everybody. I do read them all. And I, I'm not trying to ignore anybody. I love you all and I do read your comments. But it is impossible for one person to do all of those things and still run a, a life, you know. But with that... I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.